Hello everyone, this is Pop Potsy, and we are back on Let's Play series just after we finish this staircase. So this was yesterday's project, and the day before we started to work on it a little bit, and we basically finished it. So there's a couple of small aspects I wanted to get this these blocks here crafted up a little bit and get this looked at. See right here, we want to kind of fill this in a little bit, make it look a little bit better, you know? Because what we basically want to do is we want to give it more of a polished feel because we started to do this but then we built the rails system uh, by that i mean the rails on here not a cool minecart rail uh so that looks great that's looking really good i think i think you guys agree right this looks pretty good that's a it looks like a beast bulky stand it's got four wide so it's not some small choppy one and we probably shouldn't got gone so big so early on in the game you guys probably think i'm nuts but i think it looks really nice though and we're, we're gonna have more access points to the farming and farming is a a very high priority of mine. I know some people don't find that to be the case in their situations, but what I'm always finding is I, well, I tend to get hurt a lot. So the only way to combat that would be to get food. And the best method by which you go through that is obviously uh, the animals. So there's a couple of things we're going to do. Obviously, we're going to have a wheat farm and other farms. Oh, it's turning night. As soon as I get down here, this happens every time, you guys. And I always mention that too. Like, every time. Like, like you know what? Soon enough, I'll start mentioning it because it's going to be so custom to me. I'm just going to forget about it. All right, the sun's just about down. So, we will create some farms, of course. A wheat farm and those sorts of things but even before that i think we're going to focus a little bit more on the animals and i understand that actually the best way to breed them would be to have farms that give seeds for chickens for example you can get them to breed make a lot more of them there's a lot of aspects like that of course farming those things in the dirt and the ground is going to be extremely helpful in pushing forward the process but even before that i want to capture some of these animals and get things kind of set up. And one of the things about the sheep is that we're going to be able to get access to dyes. So once we've got dyes, we can actually dye the sheep's wool and get through that and make sure that we've got access to everything we need. So we've got quite a few animals around here and I feel that we should capture them sooner than later. Now, what we need to do is we kind of need to go around and of course we can do some landscaping too. So it's not like we have to find a nice spot, but it would be best to, you know, keep it as simple as possible. And what I had been saying yesterday, the day before was that this area right here looks really nice. I don't know what you guys think, but I feel that this is a very, very nice spot when it comes to farming. Now, of course, we're going to have to hit all this dirt, uh, these extra grass chunks out of the world, but that's not very hard. It's not a big deal. So we get rid of these. We build a couple of bridges on the way to here, make it a little bit easier to get to this place and access it. Eventually, of course, we'll add even more transportive devices. We'll have a, a minecart system in this entire area, as well as integrated into the huge mountain that we're living in. And that will be really incredible because we'll be able to go from there and get to so many locations and quickly too. So that's going to be cool. But that's, of course, quite a ways into the future. We don't even have the kinds of resources to be looking at that sort of thing right now but i'm just kind of trying to give you guys a general vision of what i'm seeing and what i'm kind of thinking we're gonna want to do um so yeah um what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at this so that's how we get down here from the mountain and i'm thinking the easiest way to handle this would be i can't really show you to oh that's the place you guys i found it we need to go over there right now. I was going to go nuts the other day when I was trying to figure out what the heck happened. Where did that go, you know? Like, I, I just could not figure it out. I don't know why, because it's, I mean, it's relatively simple. Like, it's on the outside, and that's it. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what my problem is. I don't know why it's so hard for me, but we're basically here now, so get up there. Get up there. All right, so if we dig right through this wall... We should actually get into that little room. So that's what we're going to do. We're just going to dig right through. Boom! Oh, we've even got a spider. Oh, not anymore. All right, so this... Oh, wait. This isn't what I was thinking. Oh, no, it is. We just... <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm like crazy. I know. I need to dig this out more. Kind of build out the outside and make this a huge, awesome ball. Basically, a room that we can use to look out around and, and navigate some things. Keep a basic idea of what's around us. And so, we're not going to work on this too much right now, of course. Because we have got so many ideas and projects and things we need to work on right now. 
that this would even we can't even stop because it's just there's so much so for now we're going to focus on the main thing that we were talking about which is the animals and what we have to do for that is we have to get more of an access way to the area that we're going to be keeping these animals and i think that that would be the easiest way to do this so what we're going to do we're going to start right here on the bottom and i'm gonna well you know what for now we'll just leave those because obviously that those aren't like super high priority we want to keep things kind of kind of in, you know in a straight organized way but we also do have to figure out how you want to do this so what i'm thinking is is two blocks enough to have no we've got to push it back a bit in fact i shouldn't have i shouldn't have put that axe away all right so let's let's go ahead and dig this back I just don't want to, I don't want things to feel cluttered, you know, there's not much worse than building something cluttered and realizing later that you can't really adjust it too easily, you know, obviously the whole game, the whole entire world is made of blocks, like everything is fixable and changeable, but some changes would take an incredibly large amount of time, you know, it's like if you have to redo an entire system for something, it could be, it could be messy, so we're going to dig back a few more layers of this dirt. And then we're going to build a little uh, wooden type ramp thing through this hill, up over it. And then we're going to turn right to get over to the mainland here where the animals are actually going to be living. And that's how we'll get from there to the home every time. And it should be, it really should be easy. I mean, I have it in my mind what I think. And I think most of you, based on what I've said, you can probably see what I'm saying. So this, this, something like this stairway will come and go up here, just a mini one. Then it will go down and it will go across over to there. So that's kind of the idea right now. I think it will, I think it should work out quite well. I'm not usually super sure of what exactly I'm doing with nature, but for now, we're just going to say we just need a little bit of a gap here because I don't want things to be, like I said, cluttered. Cluttered is the worst. And like I said, again, it's, it's, it's so painful to revert that later, you know, to make changes like that. Like, ah, no, I can't do it. So that's why we're doing it this way. Um, also, in other news, I mentioned it yesterday, actually. I mentioned the possibility of doing some Hunger Games or Lifeboat Survival Games recordings. And I actually did. So me and Ramen Noodles. Let's see. There. Me and Ramen Noodles, uh, we recorded a few episodes, quite a few, actually, that I'm going to be uploading. And... So you guys should see those up on the channel. I was really hoping I can get one done today. It's New Year's Eve, and so I have family over. It's super busy. So I'm not even sure how long this episode can go. Hopefully about 15 minutes. I'm, I'm really hoping. Um, they were kind of waiting on me, though. We're supposed to go to dinner soon. Um, so let's see. This should be... Let's see. One, two, three, four. That should be great. This should be enough. Um... So yeah, what I was going to say though, is I hope I can upload one of those today. I've got to process them all, get them chopped up a bit, because obviously there's fail rounds. I might even group all those together when things get crashed or whatever. Because obviously you guys don't want to watch all that stuff. Um, ooh, we're going to need more of those, aren't we? Okay, that's why I got a crafting bench, so we can get down here and kind of get some of the construction stuff done down here. Because obviously that's, that's, kind of, that's going to be one of our only options. What happened? Did I not have... Oh, planks. They disappeared. They moved spots. Oh, what's happening? They keep flickering around. I wasn't sure. All right, so as I as I craft these, it was giving me more options. That's what's happening. All right, so we should be okay now. Okay. We just crafted a ton. So <laughs> now we're going to craft some more of these stairs. Can I not even hold them? Oh, no. Shoot. Okay, let me go upstairs real quick and pop a few things in one of our chests up here to our little storage. Uh, this one. We'll pop some things in there. Some saplings, some feathers, strings I don't really need. We should be good. So we should be able to get the rest of this project done like this. Um, so, pocket it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. How many stairs? Oh, I've got a whole stack. Oh, great. This is perfect. It's exactly what I need. We've got... Oh, this is going to be easy. This is going to be way easier than doing from the house mountain over nothing. Placing on blocks is so much easier to do. Uh, we're going to have a block come out like this. Oh, wait. That wasn't the plan. That wasn't the plan. Shoot, you guys. Shoot, shoot, shoot. It's supposed to be four. It's supposed to be four blocks. Oh, we're doing it wrong. No, 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 no. Let me think about this for a second. Just one second. So this block... So the block at the bottom... The stairs are supposed to go one back, so that's what the problem is. Shoot, I totally messed that up. 
Don't worry, it'll only take a second. We've got we've got iron axe here, so I'm ripping up this stuff really fast. We've only got one small adjustment to make, and then we should be good. That's what I'm talking about. If you do it all wrong at the start, later it becomes incredibly hard, you know, to go back and, and fix it. So what I'm gonna do also, I'm gonna pop a torch. I've only got one torch. Oh no, I've got a stag. I'm like, really? I've got one torch on me. Uh get us some light because we do not want to be working out here in the dark. Without torches, of course, and light, because monsters will come out here and eat me. Because they just, they just like, they just like that, you know? They just like that. So now, I think we're gonna be back once more. I'm thinking. Yep, one more block, and then we should be good. So one block on all layers here. So here, there. In fact, we don't even have to do that. It just needs to be f all these blocks. So. Six blocks. So right here needs to be flattened. And then one, two, three, four, five, six. Right to there. I forgot about this. I was like, I was digging everything when really I only need to dig where the path is gonna go. That's kind of the point, is to keep it simple and easy to work with. So now if we place these oh god. Two, three. And we got the fourth one right here. And then we place this like that I'm thinking we're gonna be doing it right now so let's see yep that's exactly what we want so now we can just go up across here get this put back I know I was doing it wrong there for a second there just the front but now one two three four five oh that's wrong whoops <gasps> let's not I, I was just getting confused there because there was nothing there but we should be good I'll fix that in a second so this 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 and there we are right to the top so did my shovel break Oh, it did. Oh, let's craft another one real quick. We'll craft a couple sticks first because I think we need some. Okay. Iron shovel. Iron shovel. There we are. Okay. We're going to get this kind of... We're just going to dig out this part just for the sake of keeping things organized and seeing where our path is supposed to go. So, like this. And these raise one every time. Just like that. Ooh, it's looking good. It's looking really good. Oops. I messed up. Okay, just like this. All right, you guys. I think we might be done almost with this side. So now we need to take those fences and place one on each part of the rail to make sure we have those. Oops, just like this. Okay. Sorry, I'm, I get so focused sometimes when I'm doing this sort of thing. Oh, I can't think. All right. So we got this mini one. Now, across here, we're gonna want to have it be more of a woodish type thing, but for now we might just we might just do too thick just to just kind of get it set in, you know. I think you guys understand. I, I, I don't think you guys have had any problem with how I'm doing this, but at the beginning of the game, since we're still pretty early on in the Let's Play series, uh, we don't wanna, you know, we don't have enough resources to be doing full out things. Sometimes we just have to do small parts, you know. In fact, I've probably done more in some ways than I should have how many resources okay so now we go to the top of here get things lit up a bit more we want to keep sure we know what's going on and this is the next part of this you know what <laughs> i just said we shouldn't do it but i'm gonna do it anyway because it looks ugly and i know that that's not a reason probably not a good enough one to waste wood but it really i really can't handle it i thought i could i thought i'd just walk away i forget i forget about it no it doesn't matter no it it does it, it's gonna bug me forever so that's why i'm doing this i'm sorry guys i'm sorry i know i know my brain just my brain just can't do it it can't, it can't let go can't let go of little things like that oh that was weird it does like it does like lack things sometimes i wonder what's going on here my world is infinite and everything but it's always been so it's not like it should be some weird glitch with that you know because we started this world in this version. Oh, doing it again. Um, okay. And if we want across the back here, we could do that and then place these on top of it. Obviously, you can't see them, but they'll be there. They should show up. I don't know what's going on here. That's really quite strange. Oh, there they are. They appeared. So they got the backish going on. This, this may be another out, but for now, we're going to keep ourselves secured and safe and in and we'll probably place doors here later but like i was just saying we want to make sure we keep safe so we're going to make sure that monsters 
don't have access to areas they shouldn't have access to. For example, my house, which is right up there. So now, nothing can really get on this, on here, unless they come from up here, which they can't get in here. And they'd have to come from out there, which is, of course, not blocked off yet. But that's what we're working on next. So that's the nice part about this. And eventually, I'll put torches in nice places. Don't worry. I'll put them on, on the rails and stuff. But for now, we just want to make sure the entire thing keeps lit up. Because that's the only real way to keep this all good. And the bad thing about what we've done here is we made it out of wood. Which is, of course, the cheapest resource we can acquire right now at this time in the game. But it's burnable. So we've got to be careful. Like, really careful. Because <laughs> uh, that would be really bad, actually, if I used flint and steel. And burn the whole thing down. I don't think you guys would be too impressed. In fact, I'm very sure you would be unimpressed and probably hate me forever. And that would be the end of Papazzi. So, <laughs> so we're going to be careful. Did I, I almost worked the whole night. We better get to sleep just so we can kind of reset it. Get it back to normal. And get things rolling, baby. Sleep. Sleep. Yes. Okay. Good. I was going to say, if there's a monster nearby, that makes no sense. First of all, one second, that's horrible. I don't want any monsters by me. I cry. All right, you guys. Thank you for watching. We are getting very... Whoa. Okay. We're supposed to be careful with this. Thank you for watching, though. I hope you've enjoyed. We're going to make some really good stuff over there. This is going to be a crazy farming area. I'll probably level out some of that dirt even. Just to make sure we've got plenty of room for planes. We'll build a bridge across this way. Probably one against that way, too, because that's going to be a watchtower. But, yeah. I, I think it's going to be really fun, though. We've got some great plans. So... You guys also need to let me know in the comments. I was going to ask you guys this last time, but I forgot. I feel like we're making more progress than we were before, which <laughs> obviously we're always making progress. But um, at first I was thinking, I'm not going to make the map downloadable early because that's stupid. Like, why, why would I do that? You know, no one's going to want to play. But you guys need to let me know in the comments at what point you care to have downloads. Like, I'm assuming there's not enough in the world yet for you guys to be like, I really want to download. But there might be. I don't know. You guys need to decide what you think about this. Like... When is there enough in this world for you guys to want it to be a download? And you guys let me know because making it a download isn't the biggest pain. It's not super difficult. I'll just link you to MCP Friends or one of those sites that does the downloads for the maps and stuff. And you guys can check it out there. So it should be easy to do. So anyway, thanks again, guys. And I will see you tomorrow in our next episode.